Oh, it's good. This is the second video of my series or segment. I don't know what to call it yet. Like, I mean, it's called Designated Drinker just because I'm trying out stuff for y'all that maybe you haven't tried before or, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm drinking for y'all. You know, this is what this is about. And this lighting is giving. This lighting is giving right now. But anyways, so we're going to get right into it. Y'all, this was on sale for $10. $10. I don't know how much it usually is, but, um, yeah, sorry. It's a, um, it's a, um, recipe on the back to show you how to make different drinks, but we ain't doing all of that. You know, I'm on keto. Your girl's on keto. Now look what I found in Wawa. Hold on. Let me just talk about Wawa. Let me just talk about Wawa. Wawa pissed me off today. Wawa was very busy. They had one cashier. Poor one lady. Y'all, they didn't have a lot of drinks. Like, it seems like stock or they ran out of stuff and now i feel dumb because i went to the liquor store and you know like the little um seltzers they come in packs but i was like you know i don't want to get a pack um because my goal is to try new things whatever but then i got to wawa and they barely had anything and this was in my last video it makes me mad but i'm like i'm not gonna go back to the liquor store because it's friday night everything's about to be packed it is what it is so let's get into it okay let's get into it trust it truly this is the peach mango, um, 8%. Then we got a white claw mango. Then we got the mango, mango pineapple svetka. Okay. 35% alcohol, 70 proof. Whew, won't be using a lot of that. We got our trusty mason jar with the ice. And look what I found in Wawa. Have y'all seen this one before? Because I used to love vitamin waters. Never seen it. It's called Gutsy. Now, that's just weird to me. That's just weird to me. But um, it's called, it's watermelon peach flavor. Zero sugar. You know, so we're going to try it out. I'm going to try it out on camera for y'all. Nah. Nah, don't do it. Don't do it to yourself. Don't do it to yourself. Save your money. But we all know I got something that's going to make it sweet, but keep it keto. Hold on, hold on. I'm telling y'all, if you're on keto or just trying to cut sugar, right here, trusty, Lakanto monk fruit drops. What I'm going to do is to sweeten it up. Put a couple of swigs in there. Really, you don't need a lot with that because... I don't know, it just makes everything like extremely sweet. So we're gonna go ahead and mix that up. I don't think I put enough. All right, whatever. Let's do this before my ice melts. And it's melting. We got our ice. Now, I was wanting something tropical but Wawa just wasn't doing it today. So I'm gonna have to run it back and do another tropical video. But I'm thinking about doing like some Halloween drinks, steam drinks, because it's October. It's October 1st, by the way. Crazy, the year is flying by. Can't believe we're in October. So I'm gonna go in first with the mango pineapple. And this right here, oh, what the? When you turned 21, you was drinking this. Stop the cap. Oof. Every party I went to and kicked back there or whatever that me and my cousins had, some type of spherical was there. Take the mason jar. Probably right there. I don't know. This mason jar is big. I have smaller mason jars. Why didn't I use a smaller mason jar? Thinking through. Not thinking through. And if you hear something in the back, my dog decided to play as soon as I start recording. It's like every time I start recording. Yeah. Then we're going to go in. We're going to use the watermelon peach. You know, I don't think it's all that. Fill the watermelon peach to there. And then we're going to go in with the mango white claw. White 
that. Like that. Zero sugar pink lemonade that I had from, um, I bought it yesterday. It's almost going, y'all. Right. Remember, it's gonna be different when you're on keto and like you're trying to cut sugar and carbs. Um, you're going to have to find what works because the mixers or like the cocktails that are like the pre-made ones like the um what's that brand that i like they be having like the rum punch but stuff like that you can't drink because it has sugar in it and it's not keto so you gotta get creative and that's what i'm doing here like that's what i'm doing here let me tell you if it's going on hold on hold on I think I did something. Hold on, hold on. That is good. That is good. That is good. It's like, hold on, let me see what it tastes like. Hold on, hold on. It's like pink lemonade mango. Mango pink lemonade. That's what I'm getting from it. Like, you can barely taste alcohol in it. And if you like drinks like that, this will be good for you. Uh, drinks where you can't taste the liquor in them. And <laughs> those be the dangerous ones, y'all. But you see how much liquor I put in here. But if you like drinks like that, this is good for you. I'm going to put the, you know, drinks and stuff that I used, like, in the description. Excuse me, y'all. You know if you drink seltzers, like, they make you, um... What's it called? Burp. This is really good. And I needed that, y'all, because whew, whew, it's been a day. It's been a day. But that is my drink for y'all today. Um, I know it's kind of a lot of different things, but like I said, when you're on keto, keto, and you're trying to drink alcohol or make drinks, it's so hard because it's like you got to find sugar-free stuff. And a lot of things aren't sugar-free except for like straight liquor that you're going to find. Then you have to find things like these to mix, um, things like these with zero sugar to mix, and zero sugar. But there's a guy that I watch on TikTok and he, um, what is his name? I don't know his name. When I find his name... I'm gonna put his stuff in the comments so that you you can see who I'm talking about if you don't know him. But he makes drinks, and I noticed in a lot of his drinks he puts Red Bull. I think he said Red Bull. It's Red Bull. I think it's just Red Bull. Uh, but he puts like Red Bull and juice and liquor and stuff. I the next drink I do, y'all, I'm gonna try Red Bull. I might go get a Red Bull tomorrow and like connect this video. But that is super good, like. That's good, y'all. I needed that today. I needed it today, and I need to share it with y'all. You know, I need to share it with y'all. But um, I think on, on this series, too, I'm going to do drinks that obviously are not keto. And I think what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to make them, and then I might have my husband taste them or some friends taste them. Because, I mean, everybody on here watching is not, you know, trying to cut calories or trying to cut carbs or trying to cut sugar. So I really want to, like, reach the masses with it. But for me from for me right now i gotta drink stuff that's like zero sugar or has sugar substitutes in it and this you know honestly i feel like even if you're not on keto i feel like you would like it it's fruity first of all it's fruity and you can't taste the liquor in it so i mean i think i did a good job on it i think i did, did a good job on it but i'm gonna do another drink and um, I think I'm going to use Red Bull. I think it's like the peach mango Red Bull. I think I'm going to use that one. And I'm going to get it tomorrow. But, like, y'all, the streets were swinging when I just went to go get the stuff. Like, people are everywhere right now. People are in Wawa, the liquor store. And I get it. It's Friday, you know. But I wasn't really expecting all that human interaction. And I really wasn't expecting Wawa to be out of what I needed. 
But that really made me mad. It made me so mad. I'm going to cry all night. I'm just playing with y'all. If y'all know, y'all know. Oh, my gosh. There's this movie, y'all, that I'm going to watch while sipping this. And this, actually, you can taste the liquor a little bit. So, I can, I can taste it. But... Um, I saw it on TikTok. It was a trailer by, I think, Netflix. Yeah, it was on Netflix's account, which I don't even think I follow Netflix on TikTok. But, um, I don't know. It probably just came on my For, for You page. It's called The Guilty. Y'all, I'm about to watch that right now. Right now. I'm excited. Like, go watch the trailer. Go watch it. Tell me what y'all think. Let me know what y'all think of this drink. Like, this was something that I put together. I'm thinking on here, too, I'm going to try drinks like that I've seen other people make on TikTok um, or just different drink recipes and I might tweak them to make them keto so that I can drink them. But I think I'm also gonna make regular ones too and have my husband try them and he can tell you what he thinks um, just because I'm with him like every day. So when I mix drinks, he can, you know, taste them for you guys and tell you if they're good or if they're not good. And he's the type of person that he doesn't like tasting his alcohol. Like I think his favorite drink is, what is it? I can't even remember what it is. It's like cran apple and um crown apple mix. Y'all, that's so that's a that's not a good drink for you. If you like to drink and you throw them back, throw them back, throw them back, it don't even taste like alcohol. It's not even good for you. But um I'm gonna have him try some drinks too, you know, introduce them on my channel. And um thank y'all for watching. I'm gonna make another drink tomorrow with the Red Bull and I'm gonna stitch it to this, but this, I give this, I give it an eight out of 10. I give it an eight out of 10. Um, yeah, I give it an eight out of 10. It's giving me like mango pink lemonade vibes. Yeah, but like this, don't buy this y'all. This is not good. This is not good. And I think the only reason this tastes good, even though I put this in here, was because I'm using the pink lemonade. But, um, hold on, let me taste it again. Because sometimes, you know, you just be over-exaggerating. No. No. The only way I'm going to drink that is by mixing it with liquor and other stuff. Because that's just a no for me. That's just a no for me. Like... You don't even taste it in here. Like all I'm tasting right now is pink lemonade and mango. Yeah, that's a no for me. But cheers, let me know if you try it. Let me know if you make your own version. Comment down below some drink suggestions. Um, I need the suggestions.